Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube page in Elite Fitness. Today we're going to talk about hamstrings and the importance of hamstrings. Your quad is uh, two thirds of your leg, but your hamstrings make up about a third. It's kind of like you think of your arms, your triceps two thirds of your arms, your biceps is a third. But you know, if you have some impressive biceps, impressive hamstrings, it's going to really show. So you, to develop those, uh, we're going to do some hamstring curls. So follow me. I like to start my workout, usually when I'm doing legs, I like to start my workout off with a uh, some leg extensions and then maybe two things, four hamstrings before I squat or leg press. I've been doing that sequence for about uh, maybe the last three or four years and it's really paid off. And um, I don't have to squat as heavy or leg press as heavy and I get more out of it when I do hamstrings first. So follow me for, show you what to do. Hold the handles and curl up. And think of this as a curl, um, like a bicep curl for your legs. Same motion, you really want to Extend and squeeze and feel the hamstring. And one thing you can throw in too is some partials. Like if you're doing a heavier weight than this, this is just to show you. But if I was doing some heavy weight and I couldn't get full reps, I would just go there and really squeeze to finish off the set. Okay, that's uh, hamstring curls on the machine. Now we'll go next to uh, some seated hamstrings. Okay, this is an old machine. It's kind of old school, it's tough stuff. It's the only piece of tough stuff that I own. But I've had this thing for 15 years. The thing about it is like, I gotta use a pad and a lot of people use this pad when they sit down with it. Because this adjustment doesn't come all the way down. It's, it's missing a notch. So I'll use this to make this tighter, right there. Okay, and this, I always feel a different area of the hamstrings. This is more like where the hamstring connects to the knee right there. I feel that more so than back here, which I feel more with the, the, the uh, lying down hamstrings. And with this one you want to, I like to go slow, get the extension, and really squeeze, like I'm trying to touch my butt with my hamstrings. Get that full feeling, feels good. And the same with this one, if you want to get creative, you know, say you're on your fourth set and you can't get no more reps, get those partials like right there to really burn them out at the end. Yeah. This exercise is kind of like uh, the line uh, machine curl, but you put a dumbbell, you place a dumbbell between your feet as you're lying down and uh, curl and really squeeze your feet together at the same time when you're, when you're pulling up. It really puts a little bit more emphasis on the hamstring and you'll really feel it really good because you really got to squeeze the feet together the whole time so it puts more emphasis on the hamstrings. Oh, I think directly on there. If you haven't tried it, you got to give them a try. You got to have somebody hand them to you and spot you there. You don't want to have the dumbbell drop off on your head or your ass. Okay, another way to hit the hamstrings is by doing Romanian deadlifts. And what you do with those is you're gonna be holding dumbbells or a barbell, like here, and have your knees kind of hinge. Like you're pushing your butt back, you're keeping your back straight, just like that. That's to put a lot of emphasis right here on your glutes to the hamstring area. I'll show you. Really feel that stretch. That's the good thing about these, you really feel the stretch going down in that position right there. And don't quite lock out at the top. It's like you're pushing your butt back, like closing the door with your butt. Like visualize you got your bag full of groceries, you're trying to shut the door with your butt. Really feel that stretch. Keep your back out of it. All hamstrings and ass. All right guys, uh, I just showed you the dumbbell version of the Romanian deadlift. You can also use this thing, it's a great machine. You can use the Legend. Um, just check that out on the previous videos, that we maybe 20 videos ago. And we also got this Atlantis. You could uh, do reverse RDLs on this one as well. So check those videos, videos out as well. And uh, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.